so here we shall finally be completing the editing job what uh, we have at present is we have been able to display the records then we were able to show the details of a particular record in the edit, edit form now our last step is to perform the save let us see the theory behind it then we will proceed to do the coding you will have to understand this theory first this is the form we are showing at present order number prod amount and a save button what is shown in the address bar address bar shows slash home slash edit record slash 5 so this is showing the data for the fifth record and we reached this action method through a get request this is what is currently being shown in the address bar when you click save this is the submit button what will happen is that the very same address bar uh, address bar address will receive this data through a post because save is a submit and it is submitting to the same page to what will it submit it will submit to home by edit record by 5 this 5 edit record and home the data will be posted back to this receiver but what do we already have we already have edit record int question mark id and by default if you do not write this is always a get request if you do not put an annotation here then this is a get request by default this means when you click save there is nobody to receive it there is nobody to receive it so what we have to do is we have to create another action method with the same name because this will be posted to home by edit record the name of the action method has to be same but it has to be a post receiver and it should also have an id parameter to receive this 5 so what we are going to add is another http post put this annotation at the top action result I am just abbreviating it edit record int question mark id we should have an action method by the same name because it will be posted to the same edit record action we should have an action action method with the same name it is compulsory no other option is there because it is edit record that is typed in address bar already you are posting it back to the same action method but your request this time is not get it is post i repeat if you don't write http post here it is treated as guest get so first thing is that i need to have a post the second thing is the name must be same the third thing is it must contain an id parameter because of this 5 and the fourth thing is that since this data is being posted back there must be a receiver for this so i'll have to add another parameter to this i'll call it tbl order tbl order give it any name t or whatever you want and create a function like this so when this when this is posted back your data will arrive here you will get tbl order t this information the new information will be available to you and id will also be available because of this 5 so here you will know which record is being edited